check all parts are included with your shower enclosure. Please make sure the shower tray is installed as instructions specify prior to tiling. Check the tray is level on all sides. Once the tray is in position and fully plumbed in, tile up to the tray. Tiles and tray should be sealed using a good quality bathroom sealant. A handy tip is to use masking tape as a guideline to ensure a straight sealant line. Repeat the process on the other side of the tray. Drill three holes in each of the U-channels on the wall profiles. For measurements, refer to your instruction manual. Measure 15mm in from the outside lip of the tray. Make sure the wall profile is completely vertical using a spirit level and mark the wall through the drill holes with a pencil. Drill the wall with a drill bit where the wall profiles are to be positioned. It is advisable to wear eye protection when drilling. Repeat the process on the other side. Again, we do advise that you wear eye protection when drilling. Fit the wall plugs supplied. Screw the wall profiles to the wall with the screws supplied. Do not over tighten the screws into the wall profiles as this will misshape the wall profile. Ensure the wall profiles stay completely vertical throughout this procedure using a spirit level. Seal the gap between the tray and wall profiles with a bathroom sealant.
transit blocks from each end of the glass panelling. Sit one of the horizontal rails onto the floor and place an L-shaped panel seal between the glass and horizontal rail at the bottom, making sure that it butts up fully to the panel assembly vertically. It is advisable to have two people undertaking these procedures. Repeat the same procedure for the other panel. When the bottom is complete, repeat to fit the top rail. With the panel seals in position, between the glass and horizontal rails, Screw fix the frame together using the screws provided. Position the framework on top of the tray and place one end fully over the wall profile. Then move the framework back into the other wall profile and position it centrally between the two. Prepare the screws as shown in the instruction manual and drill referring to the measurements in your instruction manual. Measure with a spirit level that the vertical frame is completely level then drill and fit your screws accordingly. Push fit the screw covers. Assemble the top and bottom bearings to the doors. Carefully place the assembled door inside the tray. With the door the correct way round, offer the top bearings into the top horizontal rail. When in position, lower the door and press the plungers down on the bottom bearing assemblies so that the door can be placed into the bottom horizontal rail. For fitting the other door, repeat the same process. Fit the vertical magnetic seals onto the doors, then fit all other seals where appropriate.
the handles with the Allen key provided. Carefully check if the doors are parallel. If the doors are not parallel, there is a screw in the top bearing for adjustment purposes. Adjust as necessary to align the door. Using a good quality bathroom sealant, seal the wall profiles on both sides vertically, where they meet the tiled walls. Seal the base of the enclosure on the outside only. Seal the gap in the rail clip with silicon sealant to prevent leaking from this area. Fit the top caps as shown. If the top cap doesn't fit, measure and cut following the grooves and trim down as appropriate and fit. Place the branding badge in a prominent position on a non-moving part of the aluminium. Finally, to validate your guarantee, please make sure you complete and return the guarantee card enclosed or you can go online and register it at www.roman-showers.com.